Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Hot Roulette. Today we're bringing you guys episode number 24. So, last episode I asked you guys for some more line suggestions. So, I'm going to throw up the comment on the screen. We're going to keep it nice and quick. But Chase Bonholm, I think that's how you say it, gave me some line suggestions. So, I decided just to copy it 100%. And this is the team we are rolling with. So, first line of Genny Malkin, Mario Lemieux, and Jakob Voracek. Second line, Matt Duchesne, Getzlav Zetterberg. As well as Perry, Boyle, and Ben on the third line. And Parise, Sakic, and Giroud on the fourth line. So, in our defense spot, we got Cronwell, P.K. Subban. We moved up Petrangelo to the second line, playing alongside with Victor Hedman, as well as McDonough and Shattenkirk on the third line uh, defenseman spot, and Sergei Bobrovsky in net. So, our team is ready to go. Uh, we are right now on a one-game win streak with a buy now minimum of 3.5k. It's a little bit weird right now, but once we get into a couple games, you guys will be able to see what our win streak is like. Anyways, we're going to start up the first game here. Let's see what we can do. Alright, so we're starting up this game. Let's see who he has. Mario Lemieux, Patrick Kane, and Yermir Yager on his team. We got Lemieux as well on center. And we got some new jerseys. The Tri-City American, the WHL jerseys. They look a little bit different, but we're going to get this game going. Let's see what we can do. In front! Oh, Matt Duchesne! Oh, he missed a nice chance right there. Come on, to get Slav! Oh, off the post! It's already the second period and cannot score a goal for the life of me, guys. Lemieux! Oh no! Nice block by his player. Go on, grab the puck. In front! Jakob Voracek, shoot! Oh! No! How is that not a goal? Another goalie interference call. Always screwing us over. Alright, we'll take the penalty. We're now going to be on the penalty kill just for a little bit. Henrik Zetterberg! Oh man, we got an open chance there. In front! Oh, Ryan Getzlaff, another block! Come on. Oh, Matthew Shane's open. Oh, another miss. Oh, there it is! What a bad goal. Honestly, I, I had nowhere to skate, and I just decided to stand with Jakob Borchek right in the center of the goalie, or at the center of the dot, just shoot it, and we end up scoring the goal, so we make it one to nothing. All right, guys, so end of the second period so far, and we are playing pretty well. Seven to two in shots, five minutes at the time I attacked at two. We're still winning one to nothing. We need to get another insurance marker for this game, because this guy's definitely not bad. I go in oh please count that in as a goal Malkin with a slab shot and it breaks a stick goes to one of the players and let's see it's gonna be one to nothing maybe I don't know he paused it so let's see what happens here all right so Malkin comes down he takes a slap shot breaks a stick what even goes on here it's just a mess I don't even know what's going on here really like how do you not count that as a goal uh and apparently that is a no goal what a crappy call, Jesus. In front! Oh, Henrik Zetterberg, shoot the puck! Oh my goodness, and we knocked down the goalie as well. Oh, beautiful play! Oh my goodness, goalie, what are you doing here? It's on steroids or something right now. Uh, come on, grab the puck, there it is, in front! Uh, oh, Ben Bishop, of course it's Ben Bishop in that. Alright, so there it is. We win one to nothing, which means we also get a shutout this game. Definitely not an easy opponent that we played against, but let's take a look at the stats. Alright, so a pretty quiet game for him at least. 16 and 3 in shots, 8 minutes time of attack to 3. I made sure that I didn't give him any chances to score because he was pretty good defensively. Usually I get around 20-30 shots per game, but that guy was able to stop me by quite a bit. But as you can see there, Yaka Voracek with the first star, uh, Mario Lemieux also getting the second star, and Ben Bishop with a 93% save percentage also getting the third star. Anyways, we are now on a two-game win streak. We're going to raise that buy now minimum to 4.5k and choose the 16th player. Alright guys, so we're at the auction search page. The buy now minimum has been set, so let's go right ahead and buy that 16th player. So let's see what we get. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16! Oh my goodness, the long-awaited Sidney Crosby finally gets to go on the team. He is boosted up, but we're going to buy him out, see where he fits in. 
I think we just beat Hunt Real Ed, guys. I don't know. We already have Sidney Crosby on our team. I decided to put him on the first line center, playing him alongside with Evgeny Malkin and Mario Lemieux. A little bit of a Pittsburgh lineup going on there. And I mo did move down Jakob Voracek, but honestly, guys, every single player on this team can perform now. It's just a matter of scoring goals, and I don't know. Is it still worth playing Hut Roulette? Maybe it's it time to maybe sell off the team and maybe wait for next year to restart Hut Roulette. Don't exactly know, but you guys can let me know what you think in the comment box below. But right now, we're going to get into the second game, play with Sidney Crosby, and see how he plays. Alright guys, looks like we're facing Guanasaurus. I don't exactly know uh, how popular he is on Twitter, but I think you guys know who he is. Anyways, we're going to keep this going. It just so happened that we matched up with him. Oh, the flying poker Rooney. Oh, man. Haven't commentated in a while, but uh, we are facing a guy named Guanasaurus. Uh, I'm not sure how many of you guys know him, but I'm pretty sure he's top 100 in this league. So I'm trying my best to play against him. 4 3 in shots, 2 minutes time on attack to 1. He's definitely outplaying me by a little bit. So got to make sure that I keep up some good gameplay. Yes, and there is a goal. We finally score on Guan, making it one to nothing. A little bit of a tic-tac-toe play, and those usually go in. So, we're now leading one to nothing. Let's keep it up. Oh, beautiful play, turning me inside out. I thought he was going to go on the outside and maybe kind of curl around, but he decided just to do a couple deeks, and he does make it one to one. Good goal. Alright guys, so that was the end of the second period, and so far, it's a pretty intense game. 9 to 8 in shots, 5 minutes time on attack to 3. I will show you guys the leaderboards in a little bit, but so far, it seems like a pretty even game. He's definitely got a lot more skill than me, so I gotta make sure I play my hardest throughout the whole third period. Yeah, there's a goal. Henrik Zetterberg somehow finds a loose puck, and we just skate straight past the goalie and wire it on the left side of Bishop. That's one thing. Bishop can't be beat too well if you just shoot at him, but if you can beat him on the outside, you're pretty much going to get that goal. Anyways, we're good. we're now winning 2-1. to one. Let's keep it up. Oh no, another goal! Oh man, I just cannot control my defense too well. Not against Guan, but it's now 2-2. Two to two, Only 12 minutes left in the third period. Yes, we got a goal right back! Mario Lemieux absolutely rifling it past Bishop. Oh man, if there's one thing that uh, Bishop can't get beat by, it's Mario Lemieux's Stanley Cup edition. There we go, guys. Putting on the try-hard pants, and now we're winning 3-2. to two. Yes, and we finally get another one. Who is that? Joe Sackick tying it up. Man, we were putting some pressure on Guan, but now it is now 4-2. to two. Let's keep going. Oh no, I was changing my strategies and he gets a goal right back. Tried to defend the lead and I was not fast enough. Oh man, stupid by me. Alright, 4-3. to three. Oh, and there is the win. We win 4-3. to three. Very, very tough game. I mean, definitely we had the better team, so we had the advantage, but... Oh man, not an easy game to play. 4-3. to three. Let's take a look at the amount of shots. Alright, so 19-12 to 12 in shots. 6 minutes time on attack is 7. I felt like I opened up a, quite a bit in the second and third period. Maybe my guys had a little bit more endurance. I don't exactly know, but let's take a look at the three stars. Zach Parise, who did score a goal right, the, right off the bat, gets the first star. Carl Hagelin getting a star as well. And Vladimir Tarasenko. So, it is a three-game win streak. 
So we are gonna buy one premium gold jumbo pack and we are gonna raise that buy now minimum to 5.5k. I'll meet you guys there. So first, let's go ahead and buy that gold premium jumbo pack and uh, we will do that before we buy the player and raise that buy now minimum. But let's see what we get. Come on, something good. There's a new team of the week out. Nope, definitely not. Andrew Ghetto, Irwin, Moore, Upshaw, uh, Matthias, no, Toronto Maple Leaf, uh, Contracts, we got some stuff here, and more garbage. Alright, so now we're back at the auction search page. The buy now minimum has been set to 5.5k. We're choosing the 19th player here, so let's see what we get. And it's gonna be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, what the hell's going on here? 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Marion Hosa is going to be the next pickup for our team. I'm not sure if we had him before, but anyways, we're gonna throw him on, see where he fits in. Alright, so we had to make some pretty tough decisions here. I did not exactly know where to fit in Marion Hosa, so I decided that instead of replacing any of these guys on the first three lines, I'll put him in uh, Claude Giroux's spot on the fourth line, and hopefully uh, this line will still play just as good as before. So, we're getting into the third and final game here. Let's get into it. Alright, so the third and final game here. He's got Mario Lemieux, Patrice Bergeron, and Pavel Bury. Not a bad team for sure. So, let's get this started. Let's see if we can get a couple goals. Jesus, that amount of like pressure right off the first couple minutes. Absolutely just tanking that line with a uh, Mario Lemieux and Pavel Burry on it. Oh, let's see if we can score now. Henrik Zetterberg, yes! And we get that goal only a minute and 30 seconds into the game. Oh, man. All right, we got to make sure we don't play too cocky now, all right? Beating Carey Price, not bad. Oh, and Sakic once again. Just always in that right position to get that one-timer. And once again, we beat Carey Price. And now it is two to nothing. Good stuff, guys. Oh, no. And he does score a goal. Definitely not a bad opponent after I scored those two goals. But uh, two to one now. And I don't exactly know who that was. Was that Yuri Hoodler? Yeah, that was Yuri Hoodler. So, two to one. Got to get a goal back. Oh no! He gets a tying goal back with Joe Thornton. The San Jose line for him uh, gets a goal for him. Now makes it 2-2. Two to two. Oh man, I thought he had no angle there. Sergey Bobrovsky looked like he was in position. Alright guys, a 2-2 two two after 2. Want to say that for so long. But, 14-6 to six in shots so far. 6 minutes time of attack to 4. He got two quick ones. So I have to change my strategies just a little bit. Make sure he doesn't shoot on my net anymore. Because that's how he scored those two goals. Yes! Oh, he plays it out to me. Thank you very much. I'll take that. Free gift, I guess. But now it is 3-2. Oh, man. That is a relief off my shoulders. No! Oh, my goodness. What a shot. Joel Thornton on the point, and he makes no mistake. I thought I could just go right after him, but he took the shot nice and quick and makes it 3-3. Three Go Boyle, you got speed, beat him, beat him on the outside, backhand, forehand, oh no, I needed that goal so bad, back to the point to Shattenkirk, rip it, how, what, how did that not go in, shoot it, yes, bar down, Jesus, Joe Sackick, again, Oh man, you can give him fourth line minutes, but he is going to score no matter what. Oh boy, that was a great goal. 4-3 to three now in the third period. Oh, and there it is. We win the game 4-3. to three. Not that much commentary, but we did have to win that game to secure the league title. And that's what we did. Alright, so 25-11 to 11 in shots. 9 minutes time on attack to 6. 
Definitely a pretty good game for us, but we had to watch out for that guy. He knew how to score pretty good glitch goals. Anyways, going on to our three stars. Joel Sackick, so close to getting a hat trick. Joel Thorne for him, getting a goal as well. There's the stutter. And Ryan Getzlaff also picking up the third star. So what we're going to do is we're going to raise that buy now minimum to 6.5k and choose the 25th player. Alright, so I know the buy now minimum is a little bit weird. It's like at 6.5k. But right now, I'm just going to let you guys know we are on a four game win streak right now. So the next game we play, hopefully, if we can bring it up to a fifth, we can buy a special card from the market. So, anyways, buy now range has been set to 6.5k. Let's choose the 25th player. It's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. 22, 23, 24, 25. We already picked up Marion Hosa, so we're going to go into the second page here and pick the 25th player on that one. All right, so it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, Jay Van Riemsdyk. Not the highest of overalls, but he is going to be pretty good on the team. So let's buy him out, see where he fits in. All right, guys, so that is pretty much going to end off episode number 24 of Hut Roulette. This is the team we're going to be playing with with episode number 25. And we can see here, JVR is now slotted into the fourth line left wing spot. And I will put back in Marion Hosa after this game because I don't really like JVR that much. But for right now, we have to play with him no matter what because we did buy him from the market. Anyways, that is just about it for this episode of Hub Roulette. If you guys did enjoy, please leave a like. I do appreciate all the support. Anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll catch you guys later. Bye.